What's up guys, MGH here, welcome to another episode of the Portsmouth Road to Glory. So we finally finished the window in the last episode, we got our man, we've got Ribery's regen, and you guys are loving it. I did it guys, we finally got him, you guys really wanted him, he is now in the squad, if you look here, he is going to be playing on that right side. And he, he played in the last game against Hull, where we got a 0-0 draw, but the formation, the 3-5-2, didn't work. And he was kind of lost in that game. So hopefully in this next match, which I think is Crystal Palace. Yeah, it is. At home against Crystal Palace. Maybe he'll get more involved. But um, guys, in this episode, we've got Man City away from home as well. So I need to get points here because the likelihood of beating City at the Etihad is quite low. So let's get into this game now and hope we can get three points. So here's the team, guys. It is basically my strongest team possible. But Rose comes in for Eorfa, who is still a little bit tired from his injury. He will be back in the next game, but we should we should be winning this game with that team. And now let's take a look at Crystal Palace. They've got a, a very strong team, as we know. Zaha and Balassi out on the wings. They've got a decent defence there, but it could be better. Kabai is on the bench, so is Wickham. Wickham is a pain in the arse in this game because he's tall, he's strong, and he's got a good finish. But I'm feeling confident right now, you know? No, 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 no. I've given away a penalty within five minutes. Balassi is already tearing me apart. How is this a foul? Oh, man, he's gone for the shot and I've just clipped his leg. Shit. Okay, at least it wasn't a red or a yellow, but we're probably going to go 1-0 down here unless I can pull off a save. Bottom left corner. Top left. God damn it, so close. But guys, six minutes in, not a good start. It's okay, we can get back in it straight away, hopefully. We'll get a ball going up here to Maximin, who's back into the team today. We'll go around the defender, pull it back. Oh, hang on, it's working. Oh, it's not working. It's not working at all. Here goes Chevalier again, inside. Through ball, nice. And again, maybe, but over the top. Lovely, it's worked. Here goes Gray. That's a, that's a foul. Yes, finally, we get a foul. Right, this is going to be a, a good place for a free kick. It has to be McNerney. This is going in, guys. I can feel it. It's going in. Saved by the keeper. What a save. Right into the corner. Okay, so we're 1-0 down. And it's another game where I'm failing to score in the first half. This this second half is big, guys. I need two goals. Inside here to McNerney. Now into Loftus-Cheek. This is brilliant play. Inside again. Oh, beautiful. Finish it. What the fuck is that? What is that? How is that possible? Are oh, you idiot, McNerney. How have you not controlled that? We're putting the pressure on. It's good. Little 1-2 here maybe with Riley. Actually, I'm going to hit that. Go on, son. Oh, for God's sake, straight at the keeper. We may be in trouble here. Oh, my God. Fear Mosey, what a double save. How have they not scored there? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, ho, ho, ho. that would have been an absolutely beautiful goal from Crystal Palace. But only one minute left. Have I got time to get one more attack in? I might just be able to get this one up there. Over here to McNerney. Come on, one more attack into Maximin. Oh, ref, you can piss off, mate. It's another loss. I cannot believe this, guys. I thought I thought this was behind us. I thought we were going to turn the page and we were going to start winning games, but it's yet another game without a win. It's just ridiculous. I mean, looking at those stats, I had three shots, three on target. I had more possession than them, just a little bit more. My pass accuracy was 81%. It's not like I'm getting beaten badly. I just can't seem to just, just get the edge over someone. It's so frustrating. Now some training before the Man City game. And there you go. Fia Mozzi's now up to 78. Jesus. Well, he's very, very good. You saw in that last game, that double save was incredible. Right, here we go, guys. Into the game against Manchester City. They are in fourth place and we've gone down to 12th now. We have a zero goal difference. I cannot believe that's actually happened. But... This, this is going to be tough, guys. But who knows what's going to happen. We've got a very strong team up. This time, though, I've gone with Dembele up front. Let's see if he makes a difference. Because Maximin, I've been a little bit disappointed with him recently. City, of course, have Ihenacho up front, which makes me very nervous indeed. We know how good he is. Here he is, straight away. Actually, I've made a tackle. Good start. Right, hang on. Hang on. This is brilliant. Hang on. Houston's through here. Go on, son. Go on, son. Go on. We need to get a pass in, I think. Across the ground. Oh, bollocks. I've wasted that chance. We're going to go inside here. Through for Euston. He's through again. Look at this. Play it back. Go on, son. McNerney's there. Come on. No, no. He was through on goal. Here's Loftus-Cheek. Inside here to Dembele. Through ball. Gomez is through. Go on. No. 
No, 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 no! What is happening to me, guys? Here's Deba. Oh, hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Deba again. He's going through. Hit it. No, it's another save by Willy. Willy Caballero, whatever his name is. We've got another corner now. Ball goes in from Chevalier. And it's not the best delivery, but it's come out here to Houston. Over to Gomez. Hit it. Go on, son. Go on. Oh, we're getting there, guys. What a first half. We are absolutely killing it right now, but it's still nil-nil. I need to calm down. I need to calm down. I haven't scored yet. It's going to happen, though, guys. It's going to happen. This is going to be a huge win. I can feel it. We're going to do this. We're going to get a goal, and then we're going to freaking defend for our lives. Here we go. This is it. This is it. We're going to score here. Are you all for? Through for Dembele. Yes, he's out-muscled him. Please finish this. Okay, nope, stay calm. I'm not going to get angry. I'm not going to get angry. It was a good chance, but we couldn't score it. And now, corner comes in. Come on, someone's got to get there. Go on. Oh, McNerney. Yes, we've done it. Oh, I stayed calm and it was worth it. McNerney scores. His first goal in ages, I swear. And now there's just 20 minutes to go. McNerney, it just falls to him. And finally, that freaking keeper, Willie. Couldn't make a save. Just five minutes to go. Come on. Oh, hang on. I think Man City are playing on all-out attack. We're through here with Chevalier. Oh, go on. Go on. Oh, that's a, that's a foul. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys, but... How? How is that not a foul? Oh, you know what? Fuck it. I'm not going to get angry. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Come on, Baumgartel. Yes, just smack it out. Yes! We've freaking done it, guys. Ooh, that is massive. I will take the loss against Crystal Palace, but the win against City, that, that is sweet. And McNerney, man of the match for sure. He got the winning goal. That's big, guys. That is a big three points. Into the FA Cup now. The second team is playing up against Brighton, and we get a 2-1 win. So we're into the final of the Capital One Cup. And we're making progress in the FA Cup as well. Time for some training now. I've changed it up. We've actually got rid of Gomez and brought in Chevalier. I mean, his finishing is terrible. I didn't even look at that, guys. Um, he's only got 47 finishing, so we're going to improve that. And we've got his passing being improved as well. So not the best start, but I'm hoping he will reach 75, maybe 76 by the end of the season. So after that massive win against Manchester City, we now travel to Goodison Park to play Everton. If I can get another three points today, this episode would have been a huge success, if you ask me. I wonder if I can do it. We've actually moved up to 10th. That's how big a win can be, guys. And our goal difference is now one. Everton down in 14th. So... Technically, we've been better than them this season, which is hard to believe. But there's no way we're favourites after our poor form over the last few weeks, I guess. We're still the lowest scoring team in the Premier League along with Aston Villa. Oh, God. Well, let's see if we can change that today. Let's get two goals if we can. Come on, come on, come on, come on. It's a good ball. Oh, <laughs> come on. Let's do this. Another ball in. Yes, that's good. Loftus-Cheek is there. Oh, hang on. Out to Gray. Hit that. Okay, out for another corner. This time I'm going to get the ball slightly out to the left because the keeper was able to punch it last time. There you go. Not quite as good as I was hoping, hoping but Deba's going to hit that. Oh, what a save by Joel. Loftus-Cheek. Oh, that's beautiful. Over to Maximin. Hits it. Oh, straight at the keeper. What a start, though. Oh, no. No, no. Not after our start. Mane has just scored an absolute belter. There's nothing my keeper could have done about that. I can't believe this, guys. It's just my luck. I start so well, and then this happens. Oh, mate, Bashagli. It's my fault. I was controlling Bashagli. I turned the wrong way. It was just I had to predict which way he would go, and I got it wrong, and they've scored. Bollocks. Here goes Gray now. Oh, hang on. Oh, that is a dirty tackle. The space opened up. I was driving into it, but Morales. Naughty boy. It's going to be a yellow, isn't it? I would have given him a red, personally. <laughs> right, okay, a free kick in a, a decent position here. We're definitely going to get McNerney back on it. He's good at these free kicks. Let's see if we can get this one in this time. Come on, son. Oh, that's not bad, you know. Oh, my God, it was not bad at all. It's come off the post. Here goes Maxman through ball. Oh, come on, Loftus-Cheek, come on. Another save from the keeper. Right, that's the end of the first half, guys. I absolutely, 100% do not deserve to be losing this game. In fact, I'm going to check the uh, the stats because I am absolutely destroying Everton. But we're 1-0 down. Look at that. That is absolute bollocks. Absolute bollocks. 
Into Maximin. Oh, that's a good ball. Turn him. Inside. Oh, go on, finish it. No. Off the post. No, 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 no. Oh, wow. Everton are starting to work back into this game, guys. They're holding the ball. They're playing much more defensively than before. They're holding on for the 1-0 win. Look, they're gaining possession on me as well. Oh, God. This is going to be a very tough final 20 minutes or so. No, 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 no. Two shots. Two on target. Two goals. Seven shots. Seven on target. No goals. What, what can I say, guys? I mean, it's poor defending once again. That pass from Naismith. It's just ridiculous. And the finish from Pato. You give him that much space, he will score. <laughs> it's just unbelievably unlucky, though. I mean, technically, if I score now, I have got a chance of getting a draw. But am I going to score now? Or oh, I might. Here goes Chevalier. You're kidding me. Five minutes to go and we score. Chevalier's first goal for the club. Two minutes added time. I'm on all-out attack. Come on. One last chance. Ref. How is that two minutes added time? Oh, he's been bribed, just like all the other freaking refs. Oh, man. After that Man City game, I was just elated. I was feeling good. I thought I would beat Everton. And then this happens. It's just unbelievable, guys. But what can I do? What can I do? Well, at least, guys, in the next episode, we have the Capital One Cup final against West Brom. It's a chance to win some silverware. I would absolutely love that. So hopefully we'll get the win in the next episode. Um, but other than that, it's been a very up and down emotional roller coaster of an episode right now. I just feel so deflated after that game against Everton. We just need to forget it, get into the next episode soon and do better. But thank you so much for watching, guys. If you have enjoyed it, please do leave a like rating. Make sure you hit that subscribe button if you're new around here. Check out the official store, shop.officialmgh.com. And I will see you in the next episode soon. Jesus Christ, I'm going to go to bed.